The Enbridge Line 3 pipeline is flowing, and much like your monthly flow will destroy everything it comes in contact with. The Enbridge Line 3 will not only damage the environment, but the indigenous community who fought for years to make sure it never went online. Unlike your period, no one was happy that Line 3 showed up. Over 900 water protectors have been arrested for protesting Line 3, and 80 people are facing felony charges that could lead to at least seven years in prison. How should you feel about the fact that protecting the environment is a crime? Well, you shouldn't be surprised because for rich people, aka corporations, the environment is just a popsicle that you suck until it's dry. And the government is there to make sure that corporations suck that sweet watermelon flavor until all we have left is a lump of ice that no one wants. The Minnesota Police Department and Enbridge have been working together to throw the book at water protectors to make sure no one ever dares to fight to protect the environment. Because you know, the whole popsicle thing. And also because Enbridge gave the Northern Minnesota Sheriff's Office a sweet $2.4 million to surveil and arrest water protectors. So yes, it's very clear that the police are corporations bouncers. Except for it's to a club that we don't want to get into to dance. We want to get into that club to stop it from playing music that is damaging all of our eardrums. And it's time we give the indigenous people who are trying to turn the murderous music off their land back. If you like my view of the news, please subscribe to my newsletter and Patreon. Other capitalist comedy shows have ads and billionaire daddies and all I have is you.